Hi everyone, Dave here at East Rose Bud Fly and Tackle in Billings, Montana. Welcome. Today I'm going to tie you an oldie but goodie called the Palomino Midge. The author of this is unknown, but I know I've been tying them for at least 20 years. And something to remember when you're fishing midges is the pupal stage is the most important part of the life cycle of midges. It's the most vulnerable. They typically hang in the surface film or somewhere mid-depths and can hang there for weeks in streams. Of course, same thing. They rise from the bottom and they're very, very vulnerable. And the fish just get, eat them. Yeah, the hook I like to use for midges and uh, caddis larva is this 2X short TMC 206BL. I like the shape of it, like the upswept eye. This is a size 14. The Palomino midges can be tied all the way down as, as small as you want to try. I mean, all the way down to 22s because midges come in all sizes. They're typically larger in lakes than they are in streams. On lakes, they can be as large as a size 8, 2x, 3x long. Also, they come in a variety of colors. It's hard to beat green, chartreuse, browns, those types of colors, natural colors. The thread I'm using is 10 aught Vivas Olive. Start it behind the eye and get a thread base going here. To the end of the shank. Then I'm going to take a piece of this magic dub. Of course you can vary the uh, tail as long as you'd like. And I'm just going to make it about a hook shank in length. And tie it down. Okay, for the uh, pupil shuck, also to represent the uh, pupil gills, I'm going to be using some midge flash and pearl. Traditionally, this fly is tied with polypropylene. I just like the flash a little bit better than I do the poly. I'll even up the tips, tie it in right at the front of your magic dub. it down firmly and I'm going to dub a body using a new product K-Pock dubbing from Semper Fly which I'll talk about a different time but it's extremely fine the finest dubbing I've ever used for dry flies like I said this is a mid or a merger so it's going to sit right in the surface film you can use it alone, you can use it as a dropper off an adult, or you can suspend a couple of them at different depths on a lake. And build up a bit of a body here, give it a taper. And then bring the magic dub over the top of your body. Bring your wing case material over the top as well. I just like the sparkle of this better than poly yarn. And then go ahead and trim that off flush when you leave just a little bit here for the gills in front. And then whip finish. And of course, traditionally, singe the tail a little bit.
And there you have Palomino midge. Different sizes, different colors. It's a great midge to fish and very, very easy and fast to tie. So thanks for joining in, and we'll see you next time.